Continuing their wild journey, Naosi and his trusty Cessna teleport to Jupiter. They need your support more than ever. Please share this video and leave a few words in the comments. Naosi will be thrilled to read them. Usually our heroes soar two kilometers above the surface, but Jupiter lacks a solid one. We start in the upper ammonia haze where the temperature drops to minus 145 degrees Celsius and pressure is just 0.1 bar. For the Cessna, it's a vacuum, so the engine cuts out instantly, triggering a free fall. With gravity two and a half times Earth's, the plane rockets downward. In 15 seconds, it hits a blistering speed, exceeding 1,300 kilometers per hour, diving into the ammonium hydrosulfide layer, where pressure nears Earth's and temperature hovers around minus 100 degrees Celsius. Winds up to 600 kilometers per hour would shred even a jetliner. The fragile Cessna would be torn apart almost instantly. For this wild experiment, let's ignore the winds. At 100 kilometers deep, pressure hits a thousand bar, like the Mariana Trench, crumpling the Cessna into a heap the size of a washing machine. At 500 kilometers in metallic hydrogen, at hundreds of thousands of bar, and 2,500 degrees Celsius, airplanes squeeze to a P. Finally, at 1,000 kilometers with a million bar and temperature matching the sun's surface, Naosi and his Cessna would vanish completely, dissolved into the giant's depths. Conclusion On Jupiter, the Cessna won't crash. It's crushed, melted, and swallowed whole. Next stop, Saturn. 